All right, so this is something that I just wanted to make a quick video on just to kind of touch on because this is something that is kind of interesting to me and actually makes me even more excited for the Joker movie. So, the Joker director Todd Phillips talks about ditching CGI for the film. Instead of trying to live in the shadow of the MCU, let's just strip it all away. There's not one green screen in this movie. So, in isolation, that sounds pretty awesome. That really does. I mean, I, I like the fact that they're kind of going in a completely different direction with this movie. This sounds like something that we will never, that we've never seen before on the big screen when it comes to comic book movies, where there is no CGI really, there's no green screen, it's very raw, very gritty, feels very realistic, feels like something that could actually happen, and that's what I like about this movie. That's why I'm so intrigued with the Joker movie. But on the other hand, I can also see that this could potentially be something against um a, that could work against them where they are having a knee-jerk reaction where they're trying to be as um unmarvel as possible and that could also be a problem now i don't think that that is necessarily going to be a problem i don't think that automatically means that this is going to be a problem for the movie but i'm just saying that that could potentially be a problem that that is a possible red flag for the movie because we've seen it before in the past with DC uh, having these knee-jerk reactions where they're trying to to uh, to be as unmarvel as possible with you know uh, different things like you know the the um, the the mood of the the movies and the uh, you know trying to make the movies as dark and unfunny as possible and all these types of things and it never really works out that well for them so I can understand I can see how that could possibly be a problem for the movie. Um, but on the other hand, I am really excited. I'm even more excited for the movie now than I was before hearing that this movie is not going to have any sort of CGI or green screen because I am someone that for the most part, uh, I, I'm of the belief that CGI green screen should only be used when, when necessary. And unfortunately that is not the stance that a lot of people in Hollywood take. So, and that sort of uh, mentality. I am actually pretty excited for this movie because this movie is not going to have much green screen. It, actually, there's not one green screen in this movie, so that tells you right there that this movie is not going to have any green screen in the movie, which is really exciting to me, and I'm interested to see how they're going to play that off in this movie. I really have high hopes for this movie. I really think this movie is going to be pretty awesome. Um, everything I've heard about it sounds like it's pretty pretty great uh, i know that they're going to be pushing this movie for the oscars as well which is pretty crazy and uh, i hope that this, this movie does well i'm excited for this movie i'm definitely going to be going to support it um and yeah i i don't know i'm excited so you know <laughs> did they actually green screen this scene right here that's insane that is actually insane. See, things like this just doesn't make sense to me. I will never understand why movies have to do this. Like, why? Why? It's It would be the easiest, easiest thing in the world to put a wall up behind Samuel L. Jackson and put a pot on a table or whatever. Like, that would literally be the easiest thing in the world to do. But nope. Gonna just green screen it. Just gonna throw slap a green screen in the background and then just put all that in post. Um, and I hate that. I, I prefer as much... Um, practical effects as much realism as possible so you know that's why i'm ex excited for the movie so let me know in the comments below what do you think about this news what do you think about this uh potential uh this potential direction that they're going with the joker movie i want to hear your guys thought on it thoughts on it in the comments below so let me know with that being said i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll talk to you all very soon in another video talk to you later bye